I'm here with John from Sennheiser, and we're going to be talking about uh, the new TC Video Bar. John, Video Bar is a very popular product segment. There are a lot of products that do this thing on the market right now. Is the TC Bar just something that Sennheiser has launched to compete with the rest of the people in this product vertical? Uh, that's right, uh, Raya. So, so in, in this segment where it's particularly competitive and challenging, uh, we launched the product, uh, we launched our TC video bar uh, with a few objectives in mind. One was really to complement the Team Connect portfolio. As you, as you know, the Team Connect portfolio was largely made up of uh, our very successful TCC2 and the newly launched TCCM. Now, the launch of the video bar uh, is really to complement this portfolio and to work together as an ecosystem. Mm -hmm. Now, it's a unique proposition that no one has, of course, we think that we are making the perfect video bar. Mm. Um, uh, we, we strongly believe that our our quality and, uh, and and the popularity and the success of the Team Connect Ceiling 2 and soon to be the Team Connect Ceiling M will propel uh, the market of the video bars. We want to be unique. Uh, mm. We want to offer a new ecosystem. And we think we're trying to you know create something that's successful uh, um, and something unique out there. So this is really why we have uh, launched the video bar was to 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 encompass an ecosystem and experience and, and uniqueness within a, a mm -hmm. sort of like a, the video experience. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, the unique thing about video bars is they do both, right? They do video and audio. So when it comes to audio, right? Sennheiser's track record speaks for itself. I think users and consumers will all know what to expect from the audio side. But this is the first camera that Sennheiser has put out. Can users expect the same performance levels from your first camera? So I think uh, from uh, from doing video, you know, video meetings and video conferences, experience point of view, um, you know, audio it's it's optimal. It's sometimes when you when you go into a into a meeting, um, you know, people sometimes don't switch off their switch on their cameras. So audio it's it's really the baseline, and, and that's where we excel. Uh, leverage on this, we can't say that today we do not want to have video, right? We can we can opt out of video. It is a very uh, critical part of it. Both audio and video needs to be there. Now the world has changed, and and now we're in this game where we're trying to develop a, a product that has got video. So I think along with that uniqueness, we we people can expect that we actually have demoed the video bar uh, around uh, the region as well as across the world. Uh, so some of the unique features that we offer, I think 4K is uh, a baseline requirement for everybody right now. Everybody's expecting 4K, but of course, when you go into Teams and you go into Zoom, it goes into a compression. So how how that compression works is all down to down to the various video platforms, right? But I think certain features that are unique uh, and and was also working very well uh, are features like people tiling. We can do up to uh, nine participants in a single video across nine different tiles. Uh, we have a very quick uh, and very responsive uh, auto framing where you have new participants coming in and straight away the video will zoom to whoever is in the room. Uh, all, all that is powered using our camera. Um, we, we also have the option and the, the capability to, to extend uh, uh, another camera, be it a pen tube zoom via, or be it another USB camera in the room. And can you switch around between, if you don't like the camera that comes with, with us, you have the option to put in another more professional one or, or, or a pen tube zoom one that you can control. So I think this really are the unique features of the, of the camera that is going to come with the TC bar. Yeah. Um, last question from my side. I'm going to mm -hmm. take the purist's viewpoint, which is that an all-in-one solution will never be as good as a bespoke or a custom solution that is mm. created for a space. Uh, what are your thoughts on this? I think first and foremost, these are actually meant for different applications. Mm. Like, like, for example, I think for bespoke AV, we're talking about large auditoriums. We're talking about large meeting rooms where you have like 20, 30, maybe sometimes, you know, with a lot of back benches and maybe a 20-seater boardroom. Uh, in this in this case, I think a video bar would be a bit difficult to encompass everybody uh, naturally because a bespoke will work better because you have you can have three cameras, you can have microphones laid out on the table, on the ceiling, whatever you you can have video switching. 
Uh, in these large spaces, I think um, generally there aren't a lot of uh, numbers in terms of uh, quantity out there. You don't build as much large number of boardrooms as much as you build medium meeting rooms and small spice out the rooms. So I think in terms of doing a bespoke uh, solution, it is really meant to be customized and made to order, right? And you, you use things like all, all the things that I mentioned above. But when you talk about medium-sized meeting rooms, you talk about harder rooms, people want to do quick collaboration. They want to go in, use a room, book a room, go in, you know, plug in the USB and start. Start calling someone and start using it. And, and it has to be easy to install. It has to be uh, encompassing some sort of scalability and flexibility as well. So if you ask me the age old question, I think these are actually products made for different spaces. And of course, if you talk about just an all in one bar inside a medium sized meeting room, it is not going to cost as much as a bespoke solution in a large boardroom. So my, my take is actually it's just different solutions for different spaces. Yep. That makes sense. Different <laughs> products for different applications. Thank you so much, John, for your time today. Welcome. Take care. Thanks.